Hey everyone, what's up? Welcome back to a new video of Microsoft Excel series that is currently running into my channel. Friends, in today's video, we are going to learn some interesting formulas that can be used to add line breaks in Microsoft Excel with a formula and that can be used to create paragraph like text in Microsoft Excel. Friends, after the video ends, Please check the description box, there you will find the link of the excel data file which I am using in this video and have a look in the playlist into my channel which will lead you to the way to learn easily. So friend, to learn about this formula briefly, watch this video till the end. This is your host Pritham and you are watching Technical Portal YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon to get all notification from my channel. So without wasting any time, let's begin. Welcome back friends. For your easy reference, I am going to run the OSK software that means the on-screen keyboard so that you can notice which of the keys I am pressing in my keyboard. Friends, I have already created a file previously to save time. Let's open that file. Here it is. Suppose friends, you have a data file like this and you have to add these three rows in a single line or single cell. To add a line break with a formula, you can easily use the concatenation operator ampersand symbol along with the character function that is known as char char function, whatever you say char char, right? So in this example shown, the formula in E4 cell will be like this. Look at here carefully, friends equals to then at first you have to type or select the first cell reference number that is in this case b4 then put an ampersand symbol here like this then type char that means the char function look at here at the definition returns the character specified by the code number from the character sets for your computer and here you can put number 10 as the value then close the bracket then again put an ampersand symbol then again select or write down the next cell reference number that is in this case C4 then put an ampersand symbol again then again you have to type the character function here then open the first bracket then again type 10 then close the bracket and put an ampersand symbol here then after that write the last one cell reference number that is D4 you can select this and if you have more than 3 then you can just continue with ampersand symbol and character function in this case after that put the bracket close and simply hit the enter button and it will show you the result like this isn't it good friends look at here the first one is in the first line second value is in the second line and third value is in the third line and if you copy the formula from upside down the formula will show you the result without any errors so let's check how this formula actually works this formula glues together the pieces of text that appear in b4 c4 and d4 using the ampersand which is the concatenation operator in excel in between each piece of text the character function that is here and here appears with an argument of 10 the character code for a line break in Excel varies depending on the platform on Windows the code is 10 and on a Mac it is 13 it will be 13 in here if you are using Mac computer 
the result of the concatenation is text with line breaks note carefully make sure you have text wrap enable in these cells that contains line breaks look at here i have enabled the wrap text here if you don't wrap text here it will show like this so you have to enable the wrap text here so that's all for today friends hopefully you have learned a new trick and new formula in microsoft excel today hopefully you like this video if you like this video please give a thumbs up share this video with your friends share your opinion as well as your queries in the comment box keep learning keep supporting this channel and stay tuned